<laughs> Hello everyone, I'm Tina. Welcome to my channel. Uh, I'm gonna, we will start learn JSTL. The first tag library I will introduce is called Core Tag Library. And uh, this is a library we used a lot, okay? If we program uh, using GSP, you will use JSTL in almost every GSP page. And the core, core tag library is the one used the most, okay? So for this video, I will give you a brief introduction to all the tags available inside the core tag library. And uh, uh, in the future video, I will introduce each of the tag one by one, but not all of them, okay? Mm. So here, uh, core tag library provides a variety support, like uh, for a variable, if we want to retrieve values from uh, the scope, we can use uh, C out, okay? Uh, it's uh, not from scope, from the local variable, okay? Like a scriptly, those things you can use in C out. It will be similar to this expression, but it has a difference we will, we will talk about later. And uh, you can use, use C import to receive a relative or absolute, absolute URL, and uh, those information will be included in your current page. And if you want to define a variable, in each scope, you don't need to use scriptlet like a page context.set attribute request.set attribute. You can also use a C set to set a variable, okay, under certain scope. You can also use the C remove to remove a variable from particular scope. Okay. You can also use the C catch to catch exception inside the GSP. Uh, this one I don't use very often. I actually never use this one. This one I never used. This one I never used. Okay. This one did use. This one I did use. See if yes. For if else condition, you really need that. And the C choose, C when, C otherwise. This one is uh, looks like a switch. Okay. Uh, or if else. Okay. Because see if is only one condition, it doesn't have else. If you want to have a if else, 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 you can use a, a C choose, C when, C where, uh, well, otherwise. Otherwise, it's the default one, okay? It also act like a, a, you know, switch, okay? For each, definitely. This one is very important. This one is very important. This one is very important. See, for each loop, okay, iteration, you will use a lot. Uh, see, for tokens, actually, I never used. It will iterate over tokens, which is separated by supply uh, delimiters, okay? Like if you have a hyphen, uh, uh, if you have a comma separated, I never used. C prime, C prime we are used with the CUR. Okay, this one is actually very, very helpful. I used them, actually very, very helpful. Okay, I will give you example later. It will help you to generate a uh, absolute URL with optional query parameters. C redirect is like if you want to redirect to another URL, you can use C redirect, but I never used, okay? The one you will use the most is C out, C if, C for each, and probably C URL, uh, along with C parameter. The others uh, not use that often. And uh, for the demos, I will show you it's only the one we use the most, okay? So now uh, that's the that's it for this video. We just uh, introduce uh, what kind of tags uh, included in the call, and uh, we will show you the videos about each of the tag. Okay, and uh, next video I will talk about C out. If you are interesting, okay, click next. Okay, thank you, and uh, see you next time. Bye bye.